Tanya, we're going to try a little game of imagination. This is a sort of test to see if you have one. I think you do. Uh, in fact, I'm so sure you do that I've written something on the opposite side of my business card, and it has to do with some decisions you're about to make. I have something in my pocket, but it's more imaginary than the business card. Let me put them down for you so that you can imagine that you see them. You realize, of course, these are three coins. A penny, a nickel, and a dime. Mix them around if you don't like the order they're in. Somehow I knew you would. Pick up one of those coins with your left hand and hold it just at the fingertips. You'll have to forgive me, the lighting isn't all that good. Which one did you just pick up? The penny. The penny. Okay. Then let's push these away. Now I want you to flip the penny so that it lands on the table and call whether it lands heads or tails. Heads? It lands heads. All right. So with your imagination, you chose the penny. Uh -huh. And then you flipped it and it landed... On its head? On its heads, yeah. And we have a little message here. And the message, which you can see, we'll show to the camera. It says, the penny will be head side up. Wow. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stick with this. What was the design you were thinking of? Tell the truth. The circle. <laughs> Did you get it? Yeah. And over here we have wavy lines in blue to match the other set. Over here, a black cross with another black cross, and finally two yellow stars. Perfect art. Right the final piece of paper for me was mine all along. 